Bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. I'm coming from Luke, the 8th chapter, and the 22nd verse. It says, Now it came to pass on a certain day that he went into a ship which his disciples, and he said unto them, Let us go over into the other side of the lake. And they launched forth. But as they sailed, he fell asleep, and there came down a storm of wind on the lake, and they were filled with water and were in jeopardy. And they came to him and awoke him, saying, Master, Master, we perish. Then he arose and rebuked the wind and the raging of the water, and they ceased, and there was a calm. Hallelujah. And he said unto them, Where is your faith? And they, being afraid, wondering, saying one to another, What man of man is this? Praise God. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And, you know, I will leave this thought with you today. It's time for an awakening. It's time for you to awaken, hallelujah, the Savior. It's time for you to awaken the Lord. It's time for you to awaken God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And we see here the disciples, amen, and Jesus aborted a ship and they wanted to cross over to the other side. And in the process of time of them crossing over, Jesus falls asleep. And as he's sleeping, up comes a storm. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And you know, I can imagine, you know, as the, the rain was coming in and filling in the, the ship and the winds was blowing and tossing the ship to and fro. Praise God. I imagine one disciple says, you know, what should we do? And another one says, I don't know. And one says, well, you know, Jesus, Jesus is here, but you know, we don't want to bother him. Jesus on board. Let, he fell asleep. So just let's let him sleep, you know, but finally got to the point that they thought that they wasn't going to make it. Hallelujah. So they went, amen. And they woke up Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And then when and they woke him up, amen, he rebuked the storm, he rebuked the wind, amen, he calmed the sea, and he said to them, O ye of little faith, hallelujah, and you know, I'm saying to you today, is that there's things that's going on around us as we look at the COVID-19 amen crisis, and we see the numbers are beginning to, to rise and surge, amen, but you know, don't be like the disciples, hallelujah, O ye of little faith, hallelujah, glory be to God, hallelujah, hallelujah, it looks like, amen, that it's just downhill, but you know what we have to do, we have to awaken the Father, we have to continue, amen, to intercede and go to bat and continue to pray and stand fast, amen, in the liberty whereby Christ has set us free, knowing that, hallelujah, that nothing is going to overtake us, amen. Nothing is going to keep God, going to catch God by surprise. Don't we know? Don't you know? Don't I know that God see all that's going on around us? That God see that's all that's going on in your life. Hallelujah, glory be to God. So don't be ye of little faith, amen. But awaken, awaken, hallelujah, awaken, praise God, awaken God. It's time for us to awaken Him, hallelujah, glory be to God. And we wake, we awaken God, amen, by our prayer. We awaken God by standing in his word. We, we awaken God by proclaiming the word of God. It's time for us to start proclaiming God's word. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, it's time for us to stand fast, praise God, on our faith. Amen. It's time for us to stand fast. Amen. On the promises of God. You know, and I'm just thinking as I look at this, amen, Jesus was on board with them. Amen. Jesus, they had Jesus. Hallelujah. They had the Christ. Hallelujah. On the ship with them, but yet and still they was walking in fear. Yet and still they was walking in in, in disbelief. Yet and, and still they thought that they was going to perish. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And they had Jesus right on board. And the same thing for you and I. For you and I. Amen. We have God right with us. God is with us. Hallelujah. He's a present help in the time of need. Amen. He says, I'm the Alpha and I'm the Omega. I'm the beginning and I'm the end. I'm the lily of the valley. I'm the bright and morning star. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. We have him with us. Not only do we have him with us. Amen. He dwells on the inside side of us. Hallelujah. So why are we walking in fear? Why are we Amen. Dismays. Hallelujah. Why are we walking around like we don't have a hope? Why are we acting like we don't have a savior? Hallelujah. Why are we acting like we don't have, amen, a friend? Praise God. Why are we acting like we don't have a shepherd? Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. 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 I bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. It's time for awakening, saints. Amen. It's time for us to awake, amen, those things inside of us. Hallelujah. That's causing us to be dormant. That's causing us to be dumbfounded. Hallelujah. To the things that God has promised us to the things that God has said that we can declare and we de we can decree. 
But we have to know that God's word is, is, is assured. Amen. God's word is assured in our life. And I just want you to be assured today. God wants to assure you, hallelujah, praise God, that he is with He is with us. And it's time for us to awaken those things, hallelujah, and know that God is not going to allow his people, amen, to perish. He's not going to allow you and I to perish, hallelujah, in the midst of this chaotic storm, amen. I love you, praise God. Be encouraged, hallelujah, and may heaven forever smile upon you. It's my prayer.